Former President Donald Trump is using his political clout to help his former personal lawyer and fellow accomplice Rudy Giuliani by holding a fundraiser for him on Thursday. The event is expected to offer a lavish show of loyalty as Trump rallies donors willing to give 100,000 each a legal defense fund for Giuliani, who has racked up millions in legal bills from defamation lawsuits stemming from the 2020 presidential election. But it remains to be seen whether Trump will step with any financial assistance for 17 other Trump Defendants in the criminal conspiracy case filed against former President Georgia. For now, most have had figure out how pay for their own criminal defense related the alleged schemes help keep him in office. According multiple people familiar with the case, all of defendants face same racketeering charge under Georgia law. In addition to other charges involving alleged efforts to overturn results of 2020 presidential election. An expert on the state's RICO laws suggested that these co-defendants faced some difficulty in receiving any financial assistance from Trump and his campaign. Georgia RICO charges are extremely difficult to fund a defense under any circumstances. But here Trump has not only state cases to litigate, but also a potential impeachment effort in federal court, says Georgia State University Law. Professor Anthony Michael Kreese. And because PAC cash is a finite resource, diverting funds to legal defense necessarily takes away from something else. This will likely be very costly and will harm political efforts that may have a larger budget other than the diverted cash. Legal bills tend to accumulate in stages throughout a criminal case, from pre-indictment counsel to post-indictment representation which may include indictment preparation and discovery analysis. Time spent preparing and executing a defense strategy at trial. Georgia defense attorney Noah Pines estimated at trial. Attorneys who could charge $100,000 a month for an 80-hour work week earn only $312 an hour. In his opinion, if he were dealing with a RICO case, this amount would be insufficient. Multiply that by 19 in the monthly cost spiral. During a trial, criminal defense attorneys spend, on average, approximately 40 hours per week in court, with an additional 40 to 60 hours per week spent preparing for what comes next. Pines likens the endurance of lawyers who handle such cases to extreme athletes. Pines said of the RICO trials you're running a marathon over and over again every week on a four-month case. Six months is even beyond that. Defense bills in the Fulton County case could easily run into the millions. According to several defense attorneys who spoke to CBS News, prosecutors said they expect the trial of all 19 defendants to last about four months. And that time does not include the jury selection process. At least 150 witnesses are expected to be called to testify. The trials for Trump, who has pleaded not guilty in all four criminal